<laughs> it goes with my ensemble. The ensemble, he said. Michelle? Yes. Are you going to catch one this time? I better. Okay. I better. We got no flashing lights at the uh, Coast Guard Rough Bar sign. Rick? Yes, sir. Okay, good. That's a good answer. <laughs> and Brother Phil? <laughs> we are at La Push, Washington. Getting ready to go catch something. We're just not sure. A few minutes in and Michelle's already headed to the bathroom. Yes. We're headed out. Welcome to another episode of My Backyard. Today, we're going bottom fishing, and as it's the first day of salmon season, we might give that a try too. We'll be targeting lingcod and sea bass first. Michelle, are you having fun yet? Uh, <laughs> Hey everybody, it's Brent. We're on day one of a nine day fishing trip out of La Push, Washington. As you can see, it's a little bumpy on the water. This is what, what Noah says, four foot at an eight second interval feels like. And yes, I did a thing. I figured I had a week and a half before I went back to work, so I can see what my face looked like after 15 years. I don't think I like it. <laughs> The wife hasn't, doesn't know yet. She's on her way up. Should be interesting later, but we're following Gary and Steve and Gary's striper. We're going to head to the rock pile, see if we can get some lake cut, see what the weather does, maybe venture out a little further, maybe not. So we'll keep you posted. We are two miles out, and Rick is almost out of fishing story. Uh-uh. Is that true? Not a shot. I didn't think so. <laughs> we have arrived at where we're going. Now we're going to prep the gear and put blood in the boat. Brother Phil. <laughs> What's up? On site, ready to kick some lingcod butt. Yes, sir. As soon as Rick gets the gear ready. We pay Rick a lot of money to have this stuff ready, and <laughs> there was nothing ready. Mushy? Yo. How's your Sorry. stomach? My your stomach's room. fine. I have salt water all over my face, but my stomach's doing quite well. Weird. I don't know. Bradley? Yeah, I'm good. Okay. I just want to buddy the deck. All right. Here we come, boys. Phil is struggling with the sheer magnitude Shabby. of the fish. <laughs> Yeah, Brad's wondering if he shouldn't have on a life jacket. <laughs> there we go. I can't Don't oh, I'll force him out of the water. Nice fish. Nice fish. Oh. Phil? Hey. Good job, buddy. Hey, thanks a lot. Going to Disney World. <laughs> you and Dan Marino. Yeah. Brad, you are one of the smartest Taking wine. fish winch. Really? I'd like to bring in a halibut out here. It has happened before. A couple times. So, uh, Mr. Gaffsman, you ready? Yes, sir. The gaffs. And you just use a short one, right? Unless you need the big one. Yeah. We'll see. And honestly, if it's bit the pipe jig, you can grab the pipe jig. Right. Is it up yet? I uh, know. There nope. he is. Nice. Nice. Nice fish. Three in. Another octopus. Oh, no. He hooked that on the hook. Oh, did you? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, let's see that knife. Oh. Right here. Well, mm. 3 a.m. Mm-hmm. 3 a.m. Yeah, 3 a.m. I'm getting hungry. Oh, it's a little tiny Four. Guy. Rick oh, got one. A tiny Rick it's habitually tiny. underestimates the size of his fish. No. <laughs> Not this one. I think it's something from his childhood. Yeah. yeah. Little Brad. So, Phil. Yes, sir. I sent a picture to your wife. Uh-huh. And she says, nice. That's not a halibut. <laughs> Should I say, duh, or how observant of you, or something yeah. like that? No, don't get me in trouble on the first day. Okay. <laughs> All 
Rick, is that, that is that number four, Rick? Yes, it is. Okay. Nice little four and one really nice cucumber. Yeah. We've got a double coming in right now. Yeah, we got one. Rick's not optimistic no. that his fish will be Boone and Crockett material. Ah, ah. Oh, it's a crock. Yeah, yeah. It's yeah. a crock of something. Yeah. Depends, Bob. How hungry are you? Yeah. I'm not that hungry. Oh. No, I'm not that hungry. And he took the towel. All right, you know what? We should keep that. We got six to go. That's not a bad fish. Yeah, that's a keeper. Didn't mean to bang the boat. I think we keep them both, Rick. And that's four to go. That's on. Nice one. Number six. Oh, easy. There. Ooh, and took the stinky shed. Maybe we're on to something. The last two have been on. If I sit in your lap, don't be offended. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Poor little fella. I have no idea. Hey. Yeah, we got some. Hold on. Oh, wow. Oh! Looky, looky. Hey, he got off. Nice. Perfect. Okay, we got some color. Oh, Jesus oh, Christ. What do you got? A hog. Wow. Oh, there you go. Holy crap. Yeah. Nice. That's, a, that's insane. I like the scent. Oh. Wow. Oh, oh man. Hey. <laughs> 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 Look at that. Oh, yeah. I got wow. a scale up there, Rick. Number niner coming in. Good job, Rick. One to go. We got oh, nine of our ten lings, yeah. and we're going to head in now and try to get some sea bass. We got about ten miles to go. We're going to follow Steve and Gary, and we'll check in with you later. Hope you enjoyed the fishing. I loved it. Loving it. Yes. Good morning, fishing. After the ten mile ride back, I set up the deli on the dash. It's been a long day and I need to feed my crew. We need to come up with a good, uh, like a Japanese samurai warrior name for Gary. I mean, Got one? Yep, he just got one. So, okay, they're biting. Come on now. I didn't bring you guys over here to watch Steve catch fish. <laughs> Michelle's first fish. Ever. Bring Ever. it in. Just lift it up and just horse it right on in. Swing it on over. Bonus points if you slap Brad in the face with it. <laughs> Look at that. Nice little sea bass. Lay it on the deck. Can we eat it? Yes. Oh, yay. Not only can we, we, we will. will. Yay! I got a fish. That looks yeah. kind of like a crappie. Look at the colors on yeah. that, Brad. Oh, man. It's like a Frankenstein. This wasn't shipping out. It's not very big. Come here, you little shit. <laughs> It'll eat. Well, Michelle. Your first day? Yep. Your first fish ever? First fish. Ever. Well, yes. Ever. ever. Yeah. Ever. Ever. Brother Phil? Had a good time. How many lings did you haul in? I don't know. A lot? Yeah. A few. Yeah. yeah? I think he was a ling killer. Phil was the ling killer. I got lucky. Bradley? I don't know. I hooked a few. We got a few days left. Yes, we do. Right now, you Bring guys. the fish to fry, as they say. You guys all owe me a buck for the ling, but we'll see how if it holds. Day one of our nine day adventures in the books. 
It was too rough to get to the halibut hole, but we did get out to the rock pile and get a lot of lings, one short of our limit. We got nine, we needed 10, but right after we got our ninth, we lost three pipe jigs, so we figured it was time to cut our losses. So we just came in, got seven sea bass. That bite's pretty slow, we're in the middle of the tide. So I think it was a pretty good day though. I got my personal best ling by a long shot, 20 pounds, we got a scale in the boat. Phil here got a workout. Rick is no longer afraid of the camera, which is good. Yes, sure. <laughs> and Michelle got her first ever fish, which we will eat here in a couple hours. Epic so night. we'll see you back at camp. <laughs>